<laughs> now campers, we've been waiting to do this or waiting for a van like this to show up for a very long time uh, for someone like myself to show you their true colours and uh, well, it's a fine line between red and burgundy but uh, uh, GHG the red and the white uh, campers, the lid is off the Swans are going to win the grand final by 12 points uh, <laughs> big statement now, let's forget about footy uh, uh, campers uh, Golf GDS uh, guaranteed to satisfy I believe that GDS stands for uh, 20 foot now uh, golf in its day was probably, well these were about as dear a caravan you could buy uh, like a lot of these high end companies of its time they didn't do too well because uh, people would uh, they buy a lot less of them for a lot less money. So uh, anyway, Avan bought Golf, and the current Golf is uh, well, they're okay, but they're uh, not a uh, uh, they're not even close to the quality of these things. So uh, full aluminium frame, full independent suspension. They did come out in some weird and wonderful colours. This, without doubt, would have to be their most attractive option. Uh, there's a I saw one that's mint green with dark green, so if you think that one looks bad, you should see that. Now, one owner van, uh, absolutely, uh, uh, absolutely immaculate. Now, uh, high-end stuff, just some of the stuff that they would do, this is about a 2007 or 8 van, I probably should check this stuff before we get online, but um, uh, double glazed, uh, built-in blinds and uh, fly screens. Now, they're on a... Like, on a steel sort of base, again, a full independent suspension, um, condition absolutely immaculate. And uh, look good in a uh, red cartel on this thing, with a, uh, maybe a swan's emblem or something with the uh, 2022 Premiership. Um, go well after, a, uh, I think we won the last one in 2012, after we got absolutely robbed by the Bulldogs in 2016. But, uh, Anyway, that's, uh, that's enough of that. Let's go and look at this good stuff. Now, campers, there's one thing this van does and offers a crazy amount of space. So this is a full length, like that's as tall as a queen bed we've had. There's great storage under there. Uh, there is a solar panel and a battery. Now, we've worked out what, uh, why this thing feels so huge. There's uh, normally wear wardrobes on the side here, so they've plonked them out. There's a massive sort of corner cupboard here. Now 37 grand this van campers, I'm going to go early, this is not a huge amount of money. Now there's one thing they have, it's a uh, matching bit of, uh, it's got some anti-slip stuff on it so it doesn't go anywhere. Um, there's sort of slightly upsized uh, three-way fridge. And a full bathroom. So, now, there, this is where this thing is a little unique. So, got a sort of corner ensuite. Separate toilet. And the world's biggest rear wardrobe, which is uh, probably one of the most unusual things we get. There is a little vanity down there as well. Now campers, uh, 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 37 triple five tollway, no more to pay. This is a, I uh, um, can't comprehend how dear these things and what high end quality they are. They are built incredibly well. Um, uh, and this is an, a pristine example of one. Uh, not a huge amount of money to go out and see this beautiful country of ours. And can you do it in absolute style? Uh, Metro RV, thanks for looking and go to Swannies and we'll hope to uh, get you out of town soon.